Welcome to this tutorial. In this video, I'm gonna connect the face rig to the body rig in a way that is compatible for the game engine. You can find this file in the sample folder called wipet.ma and it's included only the body rig. Now we need to import the face rig from the sample folder. Let's find the face rig game and make sure to check merge into selected namespace and then import it. Now let's make connection between two rigs. First thing first, we should parent the facial head joint to the body head joint. Now select the head joint from the body rig and then select the name face all and let's click on the connect button in the toolbox. I'm gonna rename the model 1 to the face rig models. As I mentioned in the previous video, we can't use the local deformation for exporting to the game engine. So instead of using blend shape or wrap deformer, we need to transfer the skin cluster from the face rig to the body rig models. Let's select the tongue geo under facial geo group, then click on the set A button in the toolbox. By clicking on this button, actually we are storing the skin influences from the selected mesh. Now select the tongue geo and click on the A to B button to transfer skin influences. Let's do it for the other models except the head geo. Select the head geo and click on the set A. Now select this head geo. Since we already have neck and spine skin weights on this model, if we click on the A to B, we lose all those skin weights, which is not fine, and we need to keep them. So we can select only these components and click on the A to B to transfer the skin data partially. We can get rid of the face rig models, we don't need them anymore. Now we need to relax the skin weights around the border of selected components. There's one more step, replacing the skin weights from the facial head joint skin with the body rig head joint. Open the Paint Skin Weight Toolbox. Let's lock all the joints. And only unlock Facial Head Joint Skin and Head Skin. Check the Replace and click on the Flood. Hope you like it and thank you for watching.